like you don't have much left to offer. I haven't taught you everything yet. What's up guys? If you're wondering how to make smooth Twixter for your edits, then without wasting any more time, let's get started. Open After Effects. Now select your clips and enable frame blending. After that, pre-compose all the clips. Step 2, add Twixter Pro. Next, check the original FPS of your clip and input that value in the Twixter settings. Now follow my steps. Add a keyframe at the start. Press U on your keyboard to reveal keyframes. Set the speed value to something like 165. Go to the center of the clip and set a lower value like below 50. Then at the end, use the same value you used at the start. After that, press F9 to easy ease the keyframes. Step 4. Adjust the graph. Open the graph editor and follow me exactly. Once the curve is perfect, select your keyframes and press Ctrl plus C to copy. Now go to your next clip and paste it using Ctrl plus V. If your keyframes are not perfect, simply do this, press Alt on your keyboard and drag the keyframe. Um, Microwave Twixter tutorial. If you want to create that microwave Twixter effect, here's how. Again, enable frame blending and pre-compose all clips. Add Twixter Pro and copy my exact settings. Add keyframes just like before. Set your speed value, for example 170, and then use the same value in negative, like 170 for the next keyframe. Copy the graph value as I show, and once it's done, paste them to all other clips. And that's it, your Twixter and Microwave Twixter effects are now ready. So this was Action. signing off, see you guys in the next one, till end. Peace.